pump you up like Reeboks. He's not me, don't compare us. Just trust. Just so you know, I've been waiting for you. And I know what you came for. I came for it too. Soon as you walk through that door, it's on. No more waiting, I'm here now. Said I'd be home for the holidays. Home, home for the holidays. Elijah Mindset Morgano here. Mindset Morgano. See, understand that everything is energy. Law of Attraction is the best of me. 2018 Secret Sauce. We going this with episode number two. Look, what is the Law of Attraction? What is the vortex? Why are we mag being compared to magnets? Like what? But this, this is going to be a step by step, <laughs> step by step episode, letting you into how I attracted and manifested million dollars and billion dollar millionaires in my life how i attracted to writing three books and and having uh hundreds and uh, actually thousands of fans all over the U not just the united states but the world the law of attraction is real and and these are going to be some steps of it the very very simple steps one of the biggest things we tend to focus on as a generation as a whole like i used to do it continuously over and over and over and over and over and over and continuously focus on what was going wrong in my life even and even what was going good in my life at the time but this is one of the biggest thing about it like that it's easy it was easier at the time to focus on what was going wrong in my life what was what was the real meat and potatoes behind it so the, the, i didn't know that energy flows to where the mind goes I didn't understand that at the time. So now, understanding it now, instead of me speaking about all the stuff that I don't want, what I don't want to happen, or even thinking about or feeling about the stuff that I don't want or I don't want to happen, because everything in this world is frequencies and vibration. My mentor, Nikolai Tesla, said, if you want to understand the universe, study frequencies and vibrations. And that concept alone has allowed me to really tune in, tap into my frequencies and vibrations. And what I mean by that. Yo, think of a radio station. This is podcast, right? You tuned into our podcast station, our frequency and vibration. Everybody may not understand it. They may not get it. But these steps, I hope they get you through it. Understanding this is Merry Christmas. Happy holidays to you. I hope you received a lot of presents. But the most beautiful gift that you can ever receive is the presence of now. This moment right here appreciation and gratitude of the now appreciation and gratitude no matter if you're in that crazy situation that you're still alive you're still breathing you still have the ability to get back whatever you lost yet that husband you lost that wife you lost that child you still have the right to to do something with that situation it's a reason that 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 happened it's a it's, it definitely is a season for certain things that happen and if you're not tuned in tapped in into your vortex right the vortex is where our father, our higher self, our the God, the inner inner man. It's the non, the ninety percent of the non physical energy that makes up this body, right? And what I what do you mean by that mindset? Yo, we're spiritual beings with an intellect having a physical elevation experience. That's that's the definition in term. That's what I've been living and operating by. So look, these steps. Once you realize that that you have a helper, a God, a a something that is 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 greater than and it knows all the answers it knows all the answers right show a great appreciation because he got you in a situation for a reason <laughs> so now once you understand that these four steps will allow you you practice these i practice them i'm continuously practicing them once you re receive any type of resistance or contrast or you run into a circumstance instead of when you have that circumstance when you feel that uncomfortability automatically there's thoughts and feelings that of the opposite that's being sent out to that that higher self or that inner man so that those are being sent out <laughs> and they are number two they're automatically answered <laughs> so you don't always have to feel resistance to send those thoughts and frequencies and vibrations out to your higher self you can come into agreements you can ask those questions but number two is the biggest thing that most people hard to wrap their head around that it's already done Anything you ask, anything you do want or you don't want is already done. Those who think he can and those who think he can't are already both right. So step three is to allow. Start to feel those impulses that you get from being in the positive vibes and to be in those good mental states and attitudes. You get ideas, you get inspiration, you get impulses to go to this place, stop at this place. You get visions like you people come up and they start talking to you and say like literally being coming aware and grateful of that present moment. And the more you're showing gratitude and appreciation in that moment, 
the more you can start to see God in all things because he already is. But we have to be reminded. Step four, rem remember that it's gonna, you're going to run into more resistance. Now you're running into the resistance. Now you're ahead of the game. It's like, okay, the resistance, time for the level up. The level up is here. The level up is definitely here. Once you understand that I'm and now whenever resistance or contrast come, it's time for me to win. It's big. Step five is repeating step one in an intentional manner. I will pump you up like Reebok. He's not me. Don't compare us. Just trust. And just so you know, I've been waiting for you. And I know what you came for. I came for it too. Soon as you walk through that door, it's on. No more waiting. I'm here now. So you can let your guard down tonight.